Jed here to discuss how to fix choppy, distorted, or delayed audio with your desk phone or the GoToConnect soft phone. The reason why you're having call quality issues such as these is due to network instability. Other types of call quality problems include static, echo or loop, as well as one-way audio. I've created videos demonstrating how to diagnose those issues, and the links are in the description of this video. Again, issues with choppy, distorted, or delayed audio can be linked to network instability. This video will briefly tell you about three different tests you can use to diagnose your network. I've also created a video for each of those three test types. In addition to showing you how to run the tests in those videos, I'll also provide you with critical results to look for and let you know what to do if your network is having issues. The links for those three videos are in the description of this video as well. Before you try any of them, make sure that you're connected to the same network as your device that is having issues. The first and most recommended method is to download and install the GoTo Network Test Tool, which is free to use. You can find direct download links for that tool in the description of this video. After installing the tool, you can either run the test yourself or provide a support rep with the code you'll be given to have them run it for you. We highly recommend using this tool since it checks your system for much more than network stability. If you'd prefer not to use that tool, the second method involves running a test from speedtest.net to check your network stability. Be sure to select a network from a different internet service provider from the one you're using, as well as another part of the country, to see the best results. Run the test a few times so that you can have a good estimate for your network. Finally, the third method is to run a command line ping test. This can be done on a Mac or a computer running Windows 10. It is first recommended to run the test on your local area network to determine if the problem is with your devices like computers, phones, or internet switches. You may then want to run the test on your wide area network to determine if the problem is with your internet service provider. That concludes this video. Again, please view the more in-depth videos I've created if you have other questions regarding the three tests I've discussed in this video.